you are moving, okay? You are getting away from this individual. It's hitting you like a tower. It's all coming up in the open. Your eyes are being opened by spirit. You're seeing just how evil this person is, okay? Straight up evil, right? Straight up evil, and you're moving away from them, okay? Hi everyone, welcome back to Turning Tides Tarot. My name is Winifred Sanderson. I will be here doing a reading <laughs> for you all. I hope you all are having an amazing Halloween. I love Halloween. We're gonna use the Deviant Moon deck for this uh, just because the art is freaking fantastic. And yeah, I was thinking, should I use Edgar Allan Poe deck? Should I use Nightmare Before Christmas deck? Like, but this one honestly is the best choice, I believe. Um, I'm going to go ahead and call in spirit. This is going to be a reading called The Mask They Wear. Okay. The Mask They Wear. Okay. Very much Halloween relevant. Okay, let's do the thing. Calling on spirit with so much love and so much gratitude. I ask for divine guidance as I interpret these messages. May they help us all on our journey towards our highest and greatest good. I'm asking for love, joy, peace, abundance, and protection for myself, for you, and for all beings on the planet at this time. Thank you so much, spirit. Ah, darlings. Oh gosh, the mask they wear. This is the first one. This is the six of wands. Okay, so this is what they want you to see. This is their mask. Somebody here who is celebrated, successful. Others look up to me. <laughs> you know, this is what they want you to see. Okay, they want you to see that um, they are admired and well liked. Okay, who doesn't want that, right? That reminds me of like every Instagram account ever Instagrammed. Sorry. Um, I deleted mine, honestly, because I was never on it. It's so distracting and I have other things I gotta do. Nothing against those of you who are all over that, but I just can't. I just can't. I don't have time. If I had that kind of time, I would like love to be here talking to y'all in the comments instead. Honestly, I do feel that way. I love y'all. Okay, so this person wants you to see them as being like super successful. Very successful. Who are they really? Let's find out who they really are. Who are they really underneath the scenes? Oh, dang. Y'all, we talk about the six of pentacles being the breadcrumbing energy. This is who they are really underneath the scenes. Not only, and I say with six of pentacles, it can be somebody giving a gift, right? Somebody who has a lot giving a gift to you. Uh, and you can see this image really portrayed very well in this deck. Um, somebody's holding back a lot and only giving out a little bit, right? But guess what? It flew out in the reverse, which is even freaking worse, okay? So this person is somebody who takes a lot of pride. Like, look at how much I have. I have so much. I'm amazing. Look at me. I'm super successful. I've got it all. I've got more than enough and everybody knows it. I'm only gonna give you a little teeny little bit of a taste of what I really am. This person has a freaking big ego, okay? This is just like this person. I'm already getting narcissist vibe, honestly, I am. <sighs> Whatever, narcissists come out on Halloween. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know if that's, I don't know why I said that, but it just seems that like, <laughs> if a narcissist went out at a, at for Halloween, they would probably just go out as their true selves, right? I mean, if the mask dropped, you'd be like, oh dang, that's scary. That's scary. What do we have here? Another six? Wow, we literally just got six, six, six to fall out. Actually, six is a really good number. <laughs> People often mistake that. Like, you know, if you see like 666 and like your change or somewhere and something it comes up 666. Six is all about peace, harmony, and balance. Okay, but um, we had this coming up in, we had this coming up in the reverse. Okay, this is the lovers. The lovers. No, it's not the lovers. This is the six of cups. I don't read this deck a lot. Sorry, y'all. Hold on one second. I got the Six of Cups, Six of Wands, and the Six of Pentacles. Okay? Six of Pentacles. The unfortunate thing about this is that we've already picked up 
about the six of cups yes this is a soul tie yes you were meant to meet this person yes they feel connected to you but are they egotistic are they wearing a mask are they really truly somebody who doesn't like to share at heart they don't like to share who they are they don't like people knowing who they are and who they are is somebody who only gives just a little bit of something you know it's like this is this is the kind of person that likes to string people along and unfortunately for them we are telling we're telling it all right here okay this person likes to string people along okay so what do they want you to know what do they want you to know and then we're going to find out what they don't want you to know okay so just bear with me this is unfortunate 666 mark of the beast this one's mark of the beast usually like i said i mean you can get good good sixes and then there's these bad sixes this one's of the bad variety here um seven of swords yeah seven of swords this person lies cheats steals they hurt people they hurt people they want you to see they they're not they're not really hiding honestly it's like hiding in plain sight this person is who you think they are i mean they want people to see them as being very successful <laughs> This person has no shame. This person has no shame at all. They willingly, they, they lie. They take pride. They lie to people's faces. They don't care. They don't care. They don't care who finds out. Wow, this person's a jerk. I'm just going to say it. Um, okay. <laughs> what do they not want you to know? They don't care if you know they're a liar. They're a liar. They're a cheater. They don't care who knows it. It's so weird. It is weird, actually. This is very weird. We have the eight of... Eight of eight of wands here, and then we have the ace of pentacles. Flew out. What they don't want you to know. Sorry, y'all. I'm just trying to wrap my head around some of the images. I pick up some different things. So what they don't want you to know is they're actually okay. This is coming in, and this is gonna suck. This is gonna suck. This is like this person. This person's starting something new with someone else. They're messaging somebody. They're they're doing something behind your back here, okay? Um, they're they're messaging, they're going after something else, they're starting something new, they're trying to they have been keeping this from you. Um, and now they don't care if you find out. It's like they didn't want you to know at one point in time, but now with what they want you to know, they don't care. They just don't care that you know anymore so this uh, this person is a freaking narcissist absolutely absolutely so i mean i don't even know if i should continue a reading about this person like i feel like we already know what we need to know but we'll, we will okay so at one point in time this person wanted you know they still want you to see them as like the you know you know when they're love bombing this is what's going on this is what has happened. They love bombed you. They love bombed you. Then they devalued you. Okay. They made you feel like you were the best thing since sliced bread. They made you feel like a soulmate. Uh, they made you feel like it was so freaking amazing. And then they devalued you. And then they slowly, they were just stringing you along, stringing you along, stringing you along, bread crumbing, giving you just a little bit of something to keep you around, to hold you back. Because this is all fun and games to this person. It is it and I, I I'm so sorry if I'm coming off as being very like insensitive about it but really this person is an asshole okay this person's not going to change this person's never going to change this is the kind of person you want to run away from okay run run as fast as you can you'll never catch this little narcissist man or woman okay it doesn't really matter about the gen gender I was just doing the little little rhyme there <laughs> anyways okay so I'm trying to lighten the mood but because this is honestly somebody who's awful um, I don't know why they're coming up maybe this is all happening for Halloween maybe you're gonna see you know it's the big reveal the mask okay it's gonna fall off this Halloween and whatever they've been doing in secret which is messaging starting something new doing something cheating lying it's going to be revealed here it's going to be revealed, but I don't feel like they care because they're already off love bombing somebody else. Okay. This is when I'm, fuck, I hate this. I hate this. Okay. I hate this. Sorry. All right. I don't even know. Like who cares how they feel, how they really feel. It doesn't matter. Let's, let's clear the board. Honestly, I'm clearing the board. Screw this person. I don't even want to know. King of swords. Yeah. King of swords. Sorry. I just saw that at the bottom of the deck as I'm cleaning this up. 
King of Swords in a low vibration, y'all, is a narcissist. Honestly, cold, detached, zero empathy. This person is an asshole, okay? Like, sorry. You know, I'm, not, I'm sorry, not sorry. I'm not sorry. Get away from this person. This person is a dick. Okay. Let's do something about you. What's good for you? Ah, geez, let's get something for you. I just don't want to waste this on a narcissist, okay? I don't want to waste this on a narcissist. Oh, tell me something good for you. Tell me something good for you, okay? What energy do you need to... Look at this. Ah, storm warning. Damn it. This person, it's like they're taking freaking... Okay. This person is honestly... This is this person is trying. It's like they're trying to freaking ruin your life or something. You know, they're not going to. I have I have I have Queen of Pentacles energy here. This is a woman holding a coin. So regardless of your gender, this is somebody who's you're gonna do really well. You're gonna throw this in their face, basically. Okay, this is gonna ca cause a ruckus. This is gonna cause a storm. Maybe it already has. Maybe it's lingering. Maybe something's just coming out to the surface or up to the surface right now, like Halloween. Um, like I said, they could be posting all over socials, stuff like that. You know, with this new person that they've been hiding. Okay, um, that's what I'm picking up on, honestly. And it, it does it hurt? Does it cause drama and trouble? Yes, that's what a narcissist loves. Okay. Um, but woman holding a coin, this is letting me know that, you know, on the other side of all of this, guess who's going to be blessed? It's going to be you. Okay. You're going to get all the blessings. This person puts you through hell. Screw them. Screw them. Mark of the beast. All right. Get them out of here. Oh, I want to sage, but I don't have a lot of time. It took so much time to do the makeup. It's so much time. Actually, my mom's visiting and she did it. And my kid's about to come home from school. He's going to be so happy. <laughs> oh, he loves it. I love Hocus Pocus. Let me know in the comments if you love that movie too, because I freaking love it. Can you see Billy? I got Billy. There he is. Woohoo. Okay, anyways, uh, sorry about the distraction. I just want to throw some sage on this and get this person's vibe out of here. And then we will continue finding out what's good for you because I feel like you will be blessed for having to deal with this ish over here, okay? Okay, let's give you some of this. A little bit here. Oh, geez. Uh, okay, let's just do this thing. All right, what's coming in good for you? What's coming in good for you? What's this woman holding a coin energy? What blessings will you receive? I feel like you know, I just got, I just got everything they've ever wanted. You're going to get. <laughs> oh, I like that. Okay. We have the tower. Yeah. This is coming in hot. Oh, shit. Some of you did not see this coming and I do apologize for my lack of, um, just, you know, I have the chariot here. Hold on one second. Knock on the door. Trick or treaters. Y'all. Every single little distraction that could have ever happened has been happening in this reading. Okay, let's just see where you're headed. You know what? This person, this person, freaking mark of the beast. I'm serious. It just, <sighs> this message is not wanting to be released. It's crazy. Okay, anyways, I don't even want to give it attention. You are moving, okay? You are getting away from this individual. It's hitting you like a tower. It's all coming up in the open. Your eyes are being opened by spirit. You're seeing just how evil this person is, okay? Straight up evil, right? Straight up evil and you're moving away from them. Okay. Headed to better things, bigger and better things. Where are you headed? Where are you headed? The sun. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. <laughs> you know, and I just had a feeling because like, honestly, this is not fair. Having to deal with someone like this is absolute garbage. Okay. Honestly, uh, with, with the tower, the chariot, the tower's falling for a reason. Okay. This is all being revealed to you, um, for a reason. It's happening right now. Okay. <laughs> it's happening right now. It's going to allow you, it's like this final, you know, it's like this last straw that's like, okay, I got to get the heck out of this situation. I got to get the heck out of here. You've already made a decision. You're on your way and you are headed towards your blessings and abundance. You know why? Because this ain't fair. And when things aren't fair, guess what needs to happen? Karma. Okay. Karma comes in to balance the energetic scales. And this has been so whack. I can just tell that this energy is whack. Who does anyone say that anymore? Is it just me? <laughs> I'm a 90s girl. Okay. Anyways, 
yeah, abandoning the situation. Absolutely. You are not going to fall for it anymore. I feel like it is there. This person is really being revealed. If they were really good at tricking you or charming you or making you believe that they were, um, somebody that could be a better person or anything like this person is a master manipulator and their, their mask is falling. This was intended to be the mask that they wear. It's all coming out. It is all coming out. The mask is coming off. We are picking up on what would they be for Halloween? their actual evil selves. That's what this person's going to be for Halloween. Okay. Um, we have the wheel of fortune here for you. Your fortune is going to turn. Your luck is about to turn. We already talked about this. As soon as you walk away from this person energetically, I wouldn't even be surprised if you start seeing blessings coming in. And I am getting that everything this person ever wanted, you're going to get <laughs> because this is the kind of thing that will happen. Okay. Um, it may take time to heal from the situation. You may already be there, but look, we have, yeah. This has, when I said this may take time to heal from this situation, the nine of wands is like, man, this is mental health issues, right? This person caused mental health issues and it will take you some time to sort through and get back to your old self even after dealing with somebody like this, because again, they are causing this freaking storm in your life. Um, but you please know that there is a brighter future ahead for you. Things will start to work out for you again. You will pick yourself back up. You will get the help that is needed. If you, you know, you know, I, I just feel like this person is, is wreaking havoc on your life. Yes. You are seeing things very clearly. Um, spirit is, I mean, the, the friggin, uh, the friggin veils are real thin right now and you can see things really clearly. This is coming in to clear up any confusion. You're going to have this aha moment, these awakenings, and you are going to be able to see, uh, from now on anyone who is trying to play any kind of tricks on you without giving you the treats, this person, this is seriously, oh, five of wands, five of wands, five of wands. You're going to be able to see through any petty competition, jealousy, dramas, okay? This person is a drama-holic, okay? They go around stirring the pot and causing chaos and, and trying to slink away. Well, not this time. Not this time. Page of Pentacles. What is the Page of Pentacles all about? What's coming in for you? The Emperor. You are going to be rewarded with somebody who actually has integrity okay the emperor here is somebody who is mature they've got a handle on their ish okay this this is a boss energy this is the king of kings energy this is um in a high vibration it looks high vibration to me um this is somebody who's going to take care of business okay this is somebody very serious this you know how <laughs> you know how this narcissist freaking loser here seriously i am gonna say it. i don't care about judging or not this person's an asshole um this person um wanted to pretend and look like they had everything you know what this one does either you're meeting somebody like that to replace this loser somebody who's not okay um or you are becoming that yourself you're gonna become your own boss you're gonna become you're gonna get everything that they ever wanted and this is exactly what it is you're going to be in charge, large and in charge here. Okay. Large and in charge. This person, 10 of wands, they're going to be, they're going to be stuck in this energy forever. They're going to be on this, uh, karmic cycle, this negative loop <laughs> where your luck is turning for the better. Their luck is going to be turning for the worse constantly. They're going to spiral out of control. I don't even know. I, I don't want to know about what's going on with this person, but I know that you are aligning with your wishes and your dreams and emotional. It's like, satisfaction okay you gonna be happy in the end this person's gonna be suffering constantly that's it that's it i gotta cut this short y'all i'm sorry i wish i had more time it took too long to do this too long to do this <laughs> and i wanted to get the zodiacs out um i hope this has been of help if not just affirming something maybe you already know um or this could be actually happening today or tomorrow and you might want to come back to this reading even when it's not halloween and just look at this beautiful mug i'm just kidding <laughs> Jeez. anyways um i'm sending you lots of love seriously this person's a jerk run away take care